<laughs> what's up y'all it's Jay Renee and today I'm going to be doing something new for you guys something new for my channel that I haven't done before which is um, a makeup and music reaction video type thing so I wanted to start off with Brandy's debut album because the reason I chose Brandy's debut album is that it was the first album that I owned and I received this album as a gift for Christmas the year that it came out which was 1994 which means I was about 11 years old 10 years old something around that age I was really young and um I remember when this album came out and, and CDs were pretty new back then. Um, this was the very first CD that I owned. I remember having like a bunch of cassette tapes of everything else around that time. Like I had Space Jam cassette tape and <laughs> you know like CDs were, were newer things. So um, it was the very first CD that I owned which made it very special. And I remember Brandy coming on the scene. She had braids in her hair and back then. I didn't have any like role models like African American women with albinism there they just weren't visible back then um so all of my role models were black women I love to see other black women like doing really great things and you know representing us you know what I'm saying she had the braids in her hair and that was really cool to me because I wore braids as a little girl and you know you didn't really get to see a lot of braids in the media back then it was a lot of I feel like a lot of straight hair and I would wear my hair straight but it was also very cool to see someone else wearing braids who was like this big singer and she was an actress and um you know I was really into Brandy back then and I feel like when I grew up I was I would play the album but most of the songs I would play were like the singles on the album and I feel like it didn't really get to the point where I could really truly appreciate this album for what it is musically um, until I was maybe in high school. So um, I really love this album. It's one of my top albums, my top favorite albums. And I feel like it would be a great one to start off this series of makeup and music. I'm going to be doing this makeup look in the video and um while i'm also reacting to brandy's debut album and i just would love to know like what you guys think of this type of content if it's something that you guys would like to see on my channel more um i definitely have some other ideas in store and um yeah so the album was released on september 27th 1994 in the u.s and it had four singles which was i want to be down baby best friend and broken hearted let's jump right into it let's go that vibe it's like that jazzy bass Nay, don't fit me and this song is about like being yourself and Staying positive and doing things the way you want to move. You know what I'm saying? I love that. Pointed to a higher plane. Oh. I've been told from the day I was born. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't fit me. <laughs> my my speaker went out okay that's that's cool speaker gave up i gotta charge my speaker <laughs> but that would cause thing with the crown okay then the harmonies come out them hard harmonies like she didn't do the typical harmonies it was that what you don't expect you know what I'm saying I always love this song like And it just 
vibes out with that instrumental, the horns. Then we go right into Baby, which was, I believe, her first single. This was around the time where everybody had the Baby song. TLC had Baby, Baby, Baby. Britney Spears had Baby One More Time. I remember this song on the radio all the time. When you come to find I love the lyrics and songs back then. Like, you could talk about stuff without it being like, like now. I can't listen to the music now. Like the lyrics now. Mm. Nothing gain from telling you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just to be with you is all I'm thinking. What else can I say, baby? Oh, baby. We are all and I'm singing a song to you, baby. Okay, this is my part right here. My darling, oh, baby. I feel like the ending of the song is so much more exciting than the beginning. <laughs> baby, baby, my baby, my baby, my baby. You blow my mind. Baby, 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 baby. I love that part right there, <laughs> where it transitions back into the yeah, yeah, yeah. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, 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 baby, 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 baby. <laughs> okay. So this was the vibe, the best friend song. She made this song for her brother Ray J, her best friend. I, I remember this song being popular, but uh the song the lyrics don't really capture me. It's a cool tune though, you know what I'm saying? Helping hand you And of course her vocals always on point, so no questioning that. Friends may come. I like that. Du, 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 du. It's all automatic. So. She really did kind of live in that lower, you know, that lower range. It's automatic. I don't know, I don't know. From the beginning, woo. Da 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 da. I love that. And then there's a breakdown. I think this is my favorite part of the song. When you go with the road. Da -da. 
I love when they take like those different little parts and move them around the song like okay that's a vibe that's a vibe okay I want to be down I think this this is probably one of my favorite songs Brandy songs probably my favorite on this album probably played the heck out of it growing up <laughs> kind of girl that you could be down for cause when I look at you I feel something tell me the instrumental is just so dope I could be wrong but I feel like something could be going on I love that part There ain't no other for me, it's only you, yeah. Woo! That part right there. Down with you. Oh, yeah. Perfect. It's like flawless, flawless vocals. I love the lyrics too, like these lyrics are dope. More than you ever could dream of oh, I'll dedicate all my love until you call me baby Woo! So smooth Okay, 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 go off. I wanna be down with only you, my baby. I wanna be down with you. Oh, yeah. I wanna be. Tell them what you want, girl. Intermission. You know, I always would skip these. <laughs> um, called I Dedicate. And she's talking about, like, um, all the people who inspired her. Whitney Houston, of course. Aretha. Stevie. Yeah, I feel like I've never honestly listened to this whole thing. Shut Hey, this song's for you. Give you my voice. Oh, my voice. She said, I give you my voice. Very simple. Oh, okay. Now we're getting into broken hearted. Now, the intro to this. Woo. You know, and. I remember when this song was really popular on the radio. I never really gave it that kind of play on the album. I never listened to this song that much. I do like this song a lot, but it's not one that I would necessarily listen to. I don't know, it's for leisure. I don't know, it just wasn't one of my favorite songs to listen to, but it is one of my favorite Brandy songs. I guess that's a little weird to explain. Maybe also because the intro is so long. 
Like, I want to just get to the meat of the song. <laughs> I feel like songs back then had such long intros. Her voice sounds so angelic. This is another one of those songs where I feel like it gets more interesting towards the end. It's, it starts off slow, it builds up, you know what I'm saying? I love like the background vocals on this part. Love this part. Yes, this is where this is where the song goes, you know what I'm saying? I love this part. Gotta get through the whole song to get to this part. Ooh. I feel like you know that's the, the climax of the song right there. Such a simple melody, but it's like, you know, gives you that feel. Like you feel broken hearted listening to this song. <laughs> Slow, slow beat. She was snapping on this song, honestly. <laughs> She really went off on that song. She's like, I'm about to show y'all. I can sing. And it just fades out, you know what I'm saying? Thing to get over. So this song is called... I'm yours. This is one of my faves on the album as well. This, uh, I don't know. If you're a Brandy fan, you know this song. I don't mind this intro. It's a little long. A little uninteresting, but builds up to the song. Woo! No, how much you mean to me. I know sometimes you wonder why. Those those drum hits right there. Okay, I love how the song like builds into this with a beat drop. You know what I'm saying? I'm still on my eyeshadow. With all of my heart, yes, I think about you all the time. I love the lyrics of the song. The thought of you brings happiness inside I know that. Oh, she, she growled there. There's some. I can't even do it. Oh, I love this song. I love this song. When I think about you, babe, bridge, okay? Woo! <laughs> right here, right here. Your eyes. Woo! 
the matter I've got to tell you, yes, so you know that I care. Yeah, you fill my heart with love. Woo! Yeah. yeah, she snapped on this song. <laughs> she snapped on this song. Makes my dreams come true. With all of my heart, I'm yours. Okay, this the upbeat. Sunny day without you. Cloud sunny day. I love this song. This this song makes me feel happy. Like, what's a sunny day? Makes me think of sunny days. Like every once in a while, like every now and then, I just like randomly sing this song. Like it just cheers me up. The grass in the shade, I reminisce on what we had. The romance that we share. Woo! Some harmony there. But now, I love this part. Sometimes we take things for granted. Love that part. I feel like this song is over uh, underrated. Like Brandy fans don't really talk about this song, but this is one of my favorite songs off of this album. Cause I feel like it's so different. Like it's not, it's not like any other song. You know what I'm saying? It's different. <laughs> the harmonies are different. You know what I'm saying? Like it's, it's different. Brandy was an innovator. You walk out the door, and then one man says relationship. And I said something too. Woo! Don't let it overrule our love. Can we just work it out? I love what she does. Ah. Work it out. Won't you be there for me? I feel like that part is a little high for her. <laughs> like, well, at that time, like, she don't really sing that high, you know what I'm saying? She, just work it she don't ever do that either. Can we talk about hey, 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 Yeah, I feel like she was trying to reach a little higher than she typically does. Alright, we back to the more comfortable, comfortable notes. Bridge! Best bridges, yo.
Okay, I love this song too. Um, it's called Always On My Mind. Ooh, yeah. Always on my mind. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Always on my mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Lights like you all the time. You're always on my mind. I love this song because it has like those the different harmonies like the layered harmonies like she does that most people most of these singers don't be on that you can answer to me now sweet baby i'll make a promise that you can hold me too very smooth very smooth i see you seem to shake it up it's worth my thinking now. Woo! It's the way you look at me. Ooh. Woo! The harmony's there. Let me introduce my heart to you. You gotta listen to the song so you can hear the harmonies in the background. Like, like you gotta listen to the songs to appreciate all the musicianship. You gotta hear this song to appreciate the musicianship because the harmonies, the everything is like so perfect. <laughs> the part two of the I dedicate showing off her vocal chops <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. a lot of yay yay <laughs> yeah. okay this song I know this song Love is on my side. Okay, so this song doesn't get a lot of play. I've heard it a few times. I don't know it. Like, I don't know the lyrics. It has one of those long intros. <laughs> She's likely to get skipped over for these long intros. It is a pretty song, though. I think it's a pretty song. Like this part. <laughs> It's a ballad. This is a ballad song. Still on the intro. How long is this intro? The intro is like a minute long. Over a minute long. Like I'm familiar with the melody, but this song just doesn't get a lot of play. And I got you. I like that. I feel like I like the instrumental of this song. Maybe a little more than like the lyrics. It's just kind of a boring song. <laughs> I feel like it's a little boring. Just I like that. I'm definitely paying more attention to the lyrics. I mean, the paying more attention to the instrumental. I feel like if she did this song over now, like 
grown up, this song would be executed a little better. She was young, you know, but I don't feel like this was her best recording of a song. She holding a note. With some cool runs there. This is a cool song. That's definitely that's not one of my favorite songs on this album. <laughs> okay. I like this song though. And this song is more like a kind of gospel vibe. I think I like the melody of this way better, the, the beat, everything. Cause this gets you moving, you know what I'm saying? Like the, the rhythm is a little more bouncy. And the lyrics are more interesting. Got the background vocals. Okay, this part. I love the lyrics of that second verse. That snap. <laughs> no, we won't. And then we got this thing going on in the... <laughs> I love this part. In the morning, in the morning, in the in the noon day. <laughs> okay, <laughs> bring the beat back. <laughs> Love that. <laughs> That and it just it the they brought the beat back and faded it out. Okay, enough said. <laughs> Part three of the I dedicate. I'm looking for my eyeliner. I give you my voice. Oh, that's the end of that. Brought in some Maya though. So that's the end of the Brandy album. And, you know, I gotta say, it's strong at the beginning. Hit after hit. I mean, pretty much, I listened to this entire album. Songs that I would skip over. Broken Hearted. Um, and Love Is On My Side. Those are the songs. Those are songs I just never really want to sit there and, and listen to the entire song. I've been listening to Broken Hearted more lately, but, um... 
pretty much the rest of the song I listened to beginning to end, you know, like I skipped the, I dedicate, you know, interludes, but, um, the tracks, like all the songs solid, you know what I'm saying? This is a solid album for a debut album for a young, uh, artist with a powerful voice like she came on strong with with this album like a lot of times I feel like it's the debut album like if it's put together well if it's produced well you know what I'm saying like it, it's it's a hit like hit for hit but I know like some artists their their first album it's not necessarily like the whole album isn't like a banger you know what I'm saying like Brandy is definitely one that the debut album was, it was popping, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's pretty much it for Brandy. And thanks you guys so much for watching this video with me. And this is my first time doing a makeup and music uh, reaction video. And I would just like to know what you guys think of this type of content. Cause I might do a few more and see like how well they do. Like if it's something that people are interested in watching. Um, if not, you know, I'll probably just do a few and then not do any more. <laughs> but let me know what you guys think. That was fun. Like, I had fun doing it, but I don't know how other people, like, what other people might think of it. So, let's find out. Let me know what you guys think. And that's pretty much it for this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share. I'll catch you guys next time on my channel. Thanks for watching.